Hi guys, I got some European mounts here, had done up, some bucks I've killed over the years. Well guys, I want to show you this video real quick. I always say I was going to bring some chalk dust to spray up in the air to show that my scent control really does work. Um, well anyways, I have a bad wind that day. The wind was good when I first got in the stand, then it switched. Well, next thing I know, I hear something walk. I look over and there's an eight point buck walking directly at my tree stand. I'm like, oh, all right, we'll see if I get winded. We'll see how it works. I've been trying different things this year. Just mixing stuff up because I had a lot of questions about using other products and stuff to use and what I like best. Well, you can see in the video, an eight point buck walks up, beds down, 55, 60 yards to my right. Then you'll see in the clip, I'll try to put it in here. I had a couple other bucks, a real wide eight, another buck come walking from my left. They come walking right in. They bed literally downwind from me again, but they're about 40, 50 yards apart from the first buck that's bedded to my right. There you go. Come in and lay down. Check it out. Wind's blowing right away. Chalk dust. Blew right on the deer. You know, I had a lot of people reach out to me this past year about scent control. Um, it's been watching my videos. I really appreciate that. Thanks for sharing and subscribing. It means a lot and taking time to watch them. People say, hey, what's your favorite things? What's your favorite products? What do you like to do the most of? Um, well, I'll tell you, you go back to my old roots, baking soda, um, I used all the time because we didn't have the stuff that's available nowadays. So this year, I changed up a lot of things, so especially for you guys out there that's either camping um, and you're hiking in, you're hunting elk or mule deer, or you're hunting whitetail, and you don't have access to take a shower every time before you go hunting to stay clean and use your exfoliating gloves. Make sure you use them. If you don't know anything about these, go back to my other YouTube videos. I got some stuff on that. Definitely want to use them. So everybody's like, hey, how can I help cover my scent up if I can't take a shower? Well, baking soda. <clears throat> you can put some of that in little Ziploc sandwich bags or whatever you need to do to get it in there with you. But what I do is I'll take this, I'll put a layer of clothes in a bag, and I'll take the baking soda, like a whole box, and I'll put it over my clothes, put some more clothes in there, put some more baking soda. And the same, you put it in a tote, you could put it in a bag. I do contractor bags I really like, and I'll put my clothes in that, put a bunch of baking soda, and then just swish them around in that baking soda, and just let them set in this dried baking soda in your clothes. And then when you go hunting, yeah, you have a little powder from the baking soda left in your clothes but you can dust them off shake them whatever the the properties to baking soda is huge because the alkaline properties to the baking soda it helps get rid of oils and grease and everything else on your skins on your pores which creates bacteria which creates odor um, a lot of people go out there and they use baking soda that's that's why baking soda is so nice to use it's safe to put on your skin um, and that's some of the stuff out there I'd be scared to have on my skin, especially the stuff I've learned this past year. Um, so, so yeah, baking soda is safe. They make deodorant out of it, detergent. I mean, you can imagine they use baking soda for everything. So you can make a paste even, and there's people I know that's made paste, and then they'll put it on their armpits and let it set until it flakes off and helps with BO. Um, you can put it on your skin, whatever you want to do, to help get rid of odors and stuff. By putting it in your bag with your clothes and then putting your clothes on, you're getting that baking soda dust that gets on your skin which helps get rid of the odors works really really well so <clears throat> on top of using baking soda for your clothes um, you could even take a shower in it some people make a baking soda paste and shower in it and scrub down they put it on these exfoliating gloves and they literally take the baking soda and they scrub down their body with ex exfoliating gloves with the baking soda which i do a lot works which works amazing works really 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 great um or you can just use whatever you know you know bar soap you like that's scent free that might be made by whatever company is out there you use i've dead down wind scent killer scent assassins um there's a lot of good companies out there that you can buy the stuff from that i've used that's i like their soap um, baking soda works really well i use it a lot but definitely put that in your clothes and your bag now next step Yep, it's that time. The walnuts are starting to drop. These green walnuts, if you haven't watched my video on this, walnut spray, you definitely want to make some this year. You definitely want to use it. Um, you'll, a lot of people out there that's watching my videos, they've reached out to me. They use it for the first time this year. They said this has changed the game for them. 
they said they've never had so many deer so close. They've killed some of the biggest deer they ever killed in their life because the deer didn't smell them. So between the baking soda and your clothes and your bags when you're transporting them where you're going to hunt, putting them on, make sure you put the baking soda in your clothes. After you wash your clothes really good and, you know, whatever scent you want to use, scent-free soap you want to use, and then put your clothes in a bag or tote or however you want to transport them. But put some baking soda in there with your clothes. Between that, your walnut spray, and don't forget to like and subscribe and share my videos. I really appreciate it. Thanks so much.